Welcome back. We have a list of the worst airports in the country, and Rice Krispies is releasing a new flavor just in time for the fall. We're counting down five things to know before bed. With Labor Day around the corner, travel experts have tips on choosing the best days to fly. According to data collected from May 27th to July 15th by passenger rights company AirHelp, Fridays are the worst days to fly. Late afternoons from 4 p.m. until 10 p.m. is also a horrible time. AirHelp says more than 30.5% of Friday flights were disrupted. The best on-time days were Tuesdays with more than 78% of flights making it on time. New Kellogg's Rice Krispies will hit the shelves this month with an eye-popping orange color, getting you into the spirit of Halloween and Rice Krispies treat fun well before October. It's still the same taste and crunch as always, just now it will have a new look. Not the news you want to hear going into the fall and holiday season. The U.S. Postal Service says customers will have to pay a little more. The governors of the Postal Service have approved price hikes for mail sent by priority, first class, parcel select, and retail ground. Priority increases could range between 75 cents and 650. If approved, the hike would go into effect from October 2nd until January 22nd, 2023. And speaking of the holiday season, here's a list of the worst airports for cancellations as you plan your holiday travels. According to Air Health, New York's LaGuardia Airport and Newark's Liberty International top the list of airports with the most cancellations. Behind those two, we have Ronald Reagan Airport in D.C., Pittsburgh International, and Boston's Logan International Airport. With the price of everything going up, consumers are looking for ways to save, including on their liquor. The CEO of beverage company Bean Suntory says they're starting to see lower demand for premium liquors. The spirits industry hasn't exactly taken much of a hit by shift in taste, but many are blaming inflation for the change in alcohol spending habits. That was five things to know before you go to bed.